Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. I have officially figured out what we're doing with the Evo 8 Turbo situation. So I have my Evo 9 Turbo here. I'm gonna be setting this out to a company, get fully rebuilt and get a bunch of upgrades done to it. Let's go ahead and get a package up right now and then discuss what exactly we're doing to this turbo to make it handle the power level I wanna be at. All right, boys, here is a scoop of this turbo. I am sending it out to Turbo Lab of America. Upgraded thrust bearings, all upgraded bearings throughout, billet wheel upgrade, turbine housing upgrade, three inch anti surge cover, and I think that's about it. It should be able to pull a bit more power out of it now. I'm so freaking excited for this, guys. It's gonna make good power. It should be reliable. I'm gonna send that turbo out today. I'm guessing it'll be about a week to two weeks to get the turbo back, and then we can throw it back on the car. I'm gonna pick this video back up when that turbo comes back home. See you guys then. Yo guys, it's been a couple weeks since I sent the turbo out and today we got the turbo back in. Let's go open it up. That is a big boy turbo. It is so beautiful too. It's like brand freaking new. So what they did, they took my factory Evo 9 Turbo, which I was running on my car. That car made 420 horsepower, 400 foot pounds of torque on the Evo 9 Turbo. Yeah, you guys have heard that story about a million times, but if you're new here, that's what it made on the Evo 9 Turbo. Guys, this turbo turned out absolutely amazing. They did so much to this turbo. I know it's converted into a 25G now, which is substantially larger than what it was. I think before it was considered an 18G. It looks like they ported the hot side. All new bearings, of course. It looks like there's a dual blade billet wheel in here. They did a lot to this turbo. And it looks brand new too. Check it out. That's gorgeous. That is absolutely gorgeous. This is why I needed the bigger fuel pump in the car. If you guys didn't see that video, it, sh it was probably up yesterday. We did the Walbro 450 pump. And I think that with this turbo setup and the rest of the car, we should be able to get a good amount over 500 horse on this Evo 8. Guys, if you need any turbo work done whatsoever, make sure you hit up Turbo Lab of America. I'll have them linked down in the description box below. Go send them a message, talk to them, talk about your goals. They're very, very smart with like, you, you let them know your goals, your horsepower goals, your torque goals, how do you want your power curve to be. And they'll literally build you a turbo like this to suit the, those power goals. Did they really fix that? They freaking fixed that. My turbo is cracked right here where the downpipe bolt's on and it looks like they welded it and re-threaded it. So that's absolutely crazy. And I didn't even ask him to do that. Link down below, go hit him up. I'll also have their Instagram on the screen. Before we go install this turbo, they sent me a bunch of old parts from my old turbo. Look at this turbine wheel. This thing is destroyed. That is absolutely crazy. Ho ho ho. We are gonna be doing a giveaway with this turbine wheel. Stay tuned till the end of the video. Let's go slap this turbo onto the Evo 8. All right, boys, this is it. The car is all done. Oil level's good, coolant level's good, turbo's on. Let's go ahead, fire it up, see if it runs.
let it warm up a little bit, check, check the coolant level again, check the oil, and make sure it's all good to go. I shut it off, let it cool down a little bit, recheck the oil and the coolant levels. It's all good to go. Let's take it on our first drive. Hopefully we don't have any issues whatsoever. I think we should be good to go. So it sounds super healthy. Turbo sounds good, not making any noises. It's not leaking or anything. Let's go hit the roads. That turbo is so loud. Being that I'm not tuned at all though for this new setup, uh, Mark specifically said no boost whatsoever. So you should probably listen to him this time around and be safe on it. absolutely phenomenal no weird issues no noises no nothing it sounds really really good turbo is quite a bit louder than what it was before so that's always a plus um, yeah we changed quite a bit of stuff on the car and it's running good we definitely need to tune the car for the new turbo setup and the fuel pump but other than that everything should be good to go So good to have this car back on the streets, back out of the shop, and just driving the car again. It's so nice to drive this car. I really, really do enjoy driving this thing. Let's pop the hood on it and take a look at how the engine bay is looking right now. I think it looks really good with all the new powder coated piping, valve cover, all the blue stuff we got going on. I really need to do the exhaust manifold, like ceramic coated or something. But yeah, check it out, it looks really good. I think it turned out absolutely sick. Huge shout out to Turbo Lab of America for building this turbo for me. Should make some pretty good power. Shout out to John from JD Customs for supplying the fuel pump. Shout out to Mark from Apex Power for all my tuning. Shout out to, oh man, who else? Prismatic Powders for all the powder they've supplied for this car. Who else? I, I'm missing more people. I know I'm missing more people. Uh, spooling up for all the harnesses. Who else, who else? There's been a lot of lot of help with this car build and I can't thank all my sponsors enough. Once again, if you need any turbos built whatsoever, rebuilt, upgraded, any of that good stuff, hit up Turbo Lab of America. I'll have a link down in the description box below. I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video right here. I'm too stoked. I'm gonna go drive this thing around a little bit. Obviously not getting into boost until we tune it, but yeah, I'm hyped, I'm freaking hyped. Let's go run to the house real quick and talk about this giveaway, little giveaway we're doing with the old turbine wheel. Should be pretty fun. So if you made it this far in the video, I have a little surprise for one of you guys. If you want to win a piece of this car to keep with you forever, I'm going to be signing this and sending it off to one of you guys. And this is how you win. Go down in the comment section below and just drop a comment and let me know why you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. That's all you have to do. It could be for any reason whatsoever. I'll be picking the winner in about 24 hours. I'm going to take this completely destroyed, chewed up turbine wheel, signing it and sending it off to one lucky winner. If you guys are as hyped as I am to get this car tuned and make some really good power with this new turbo, go down below, smash that thumbs up button. Once again, huge shout out to my boys over at Turbo Lab of America for sending me, for building me, and sending me this absolutely gorgeous turbo. Sounds really good, and I hope it makes good power. I know it's gonna make good power. Thank you guys so much for watching that video. I'll catch you in the next one.